Welcome to the Hobby Lobby Creative Studio. I'm Kaylee, and today we are going big with Deco Mesh Ribbon. Now, I'm sure you've seen Deco Mesh decor like this before, but did you know how easy it is to make? Let me show you the basics. First things first, what is Deco Mesh? Well, it's actually a poly mesh ribbon that's designed to hold its shape well while also being durable and waterproof. So it's perfect for both indoor and outdoor crafts, like this lantern topper. We made it by securing big loops and curls of deco mesh together with Chanel stems, forming a bow-like poof, and then added a cute witch hat to complete this pop of Halloween fun. At Hobby Lobby, you'll find deco mesh in three widths, five and a half inches, 10 inches, and 21 inches. As for colors and patterns, well, there are too many to count. The two main types, though, are basic and premium. Basic deco mesh typically has a hint of glittery thread woven into it, while premium deco mesh is all about the bold metallic statement. For a more natural look, there's also burlap style mesh like this. For cutting your deco mesh, all you need is a pair of regular scissors. There isn't any wire in this ribbon, yet much like wire edge ribbon, deco mesh holds its shape really well. So you get the best of both worlds. See how this bow has stayed big and fluffy on our bride's chair here? It steals the show and stays looking great even during outdoor weddings. Wreaths are one of the most popular crafts made from deco mesh. So I'm gonna show you how to make one. First, you'll need a wreath form from our floral department. If you choose a metal one like this, you'll also need Chanel stems or other ties to attach the mesh ribbon with. Or you can get a wreath form with the Chanel stems already on it, which is what I'll be using for this wreath. After I've attached the end of this 21 inch deco mesh to the wreath form, I can just loop the ribbon to the next tie like this. I'm using the inside ring of the wreath form first, and on the second time around, I'll use the outer ring. Make sure to pull enough ribbon to make your loops nice and big like this. That's what will give the wreath its fullness. Once you've gone around your wreath form two times, you can easily situate and rearrange the loops however you'd like them. And if you want the wreath to be fuller, just add another layer of ribbon. You could even add in regular ribbon for even more color and texture like we've done on ours. The only thing left to do now is hiding the Chanel stems. Just pull them to the back of the wreath so they're hidden behind all the ribbon. Twist them into place and your wreath is ready to be hung. Here's another style of wreath that's just as simple to make as the first. Instead of one long length of deco mesh though, you'll need to cut a bunch of pieces that are each about 16 inches long. For mine, I'm using two types of deco mesh and a roll of ribbon. Roll three pieces of ribbon long ways like this, then stack them on top of each other. We added wire-edged ribbon to ours as well. Now wrap a Chanel stem around the middle here and attach it to your wire wreath form. This doubles up the ribbons and keeps them nice and curly. Just keep going around until your wreath is as full as you want it. When you're all done, you can personalize it with monogram letters like we did for our little girl's room. These same techniques can be used to make other fun projects, like lighted garlands. All you need is a garland from our floral department, which you'll then wrap with twinkle lights. Attach deco mesh to it with Chanel stems and you're done. This patriotic garland came together in no time using these same simple steps. Don't you love how perfectly it finishes off the mantle? One last irresistible place to use deco mesh is on your Christmas tree. Just weave your ribbon throughout the tree, securing it every so often to the branches with Chanel stems. That's it. Big impact, minimal effort. For more detailed instructions on how to do that, check out our Christmas Basics ribbon and filler video. And there you have it, an introduction to deco mesh ribbon. Now you can go get your own and start making easy one-of-a-kind pieces for your home. For more ideas and inspiration, be sure to check out our other videos, and I'll see you next time here at the Hobby Lobby Creative Studio.